Assalamu alaikum and good day. My name is Dr. Fawad Rizvi and I'm working as a Chief Consultant Ophthalmologist in LRBDI Hospital. LRBDI Hospitals, it's a network of around 19 hospitals and 60 eye care centers which provide free eye care services to the needy people of Pakistan. And this is the biggest NGO in Pakistan. As far as uh, uh, LRBT is concerned, we take care of not only adult patients, we also look uh, uh, after the children and children eye ailments. And to tell you that this year, the World Side Day is commemorated for the management and uh, treatment of eye ailments in children and young adults. So as far as the children is concerned, LRBT almost treats one third of the eye ailments in children and young adults of whole of Pakistan. So as far as eye ailments in children are concerned, primarily there are certain misconceptions that wearing glasses, treating squints, and uh, examination of the eye, especially in infants and newborns is very important because we are dealing with certain diseases like retinopathy or prematurity, which is very common in those patients who are born at an early age, who are preterm, who are low birth weight, and ROP is one of the leading cause of total blindness in these children. So early evaluation, early screening of these patients who require treatment of ROP will help prevent total blindness in these children. Similarly, treatment of squint, there's a misconception that squint does not need to be treated early. No, it's the other way. The students or the children who require a squint treatment should be treated as early as possible. Similarly, around 30 to 40 percent of the children who have got some kind of eye problem, it's because of the refractive errors. So wearing glasses at an early age is very important, especially in children. So at this World Side Day, where the theme is that treating children and young adults, I will prefer the parents and their caretakers to please have your children's eye checked as early as possible. Apart from the awareness, also I would like to request to the philanthropists and all the uh, organizations who can help in this cause in treating, helping LRBT in managing treatment of these children. Thank you.